All right, <clears throat> greetings from uh, northern Wisconsin, where we're still dealing with the uh, the great northern glacier of 2018 that uh, refuses to recede. Uh, we're out here by the uh, the hay barn and. Uh, you can see there's quite a bit of snow around the tractor there and another what three foot drift here in front of the hay barn uh, it's hard to believe that it's April 15th April 15th it's as close to May as it is to March and uh, we just over the last two days got I don't know another 20 inches of snow and we're still in the middle of it uh, these guys have been hanging in there they uh, they know where to get out of the wind so they're uh, they're doing they're doing okay they don't like it uh, this time of year last year uh, the pastures were already greening up uh, by this time we were done with syrup maple syrup and um, the trees were budding and uh, today here on April 15th we've still got uh, a good 18 inches to two feet of snow everywhere uh, it's the hardest syrup season we've ever had we've only collected twice because the snow is too deep to get back in the woods and then once you got back in the woods with a tractor and a wagon, it was too hard to walk around. So we've got 300 gallons of sap in a in a bulk tank, milk bulk tank that we store it in. Uh, but uh, the cold has slowed down the sap. Uh, our concern is that if it if it if it goes back to normal, uh, we're going to have no the season's just going to end because. The trees are going to bud. It should be summer almost 50 degrees is almost the, the average high this time of year with uh, low 30s, high 20s at night. Uh, and right now on April 15th it looks more like it did back on January 15th uh, than it should this time of year. We just broke this. Uh, we're up by Minneapolis, St. Paul, a little bit north and east, and um, this current storm just broke the record for the snowiest April ever uh, by several inches, and we still have half the month left to go. So uh, sooner or later, uh, it, it should be spring. Uh, average ice out this time of year uh, April 15th is uh, yeah ice out April 15th and some guys on a lake nearby uh, went out on it and uh, took an auger and bored down and uh, the ice still 32 inches thick 32 inches thick now with a another 20 inches of snow on top of that and uh, usually this is the average ice out for lakes up here. So I uh, hope everybody else is enjoying some spring-like weather. Uh, we're pretty much done with this. Uh, although we know that uh, uh, whining about the weather up here really doesn't do anything and, and our weather is an inconvenience. I have a friend who lives out in Santa Barbara and um, his extreme weather out there uh, results in whole neighborhoods being burnt down and floods pouring mud down town in Montecito uh, so they have pretty destructive extreme weather we just get inconvenienced and whine and and we get how lucky we are uh, these guys here aren't feeling particularly lucky right now but uh, that's the way it is up here way up north April 15th, holy cow, 
Uh, we just can't wait for this to, to get over. And there's really no getting over it on the horizon. Uh, we'll see what happens. Uh, when, when it changes, I'll do another one of these. Uh, I, th I hope we have enough hay to make it into pasture. There's plenty of hay around. Uh, yeah, okay, that's it. Uh, have, a, have a nice afternoon. And uh, I just thought I'd show you this.